since I retain water. All right. And you know this menu has to appease me. Yes. These are my friends, and particularly in my case, where I'm the event planner as well, it's all about my work. Some kind of greens, maybe a bok choy. Bok choy? Yeah. I was thinking about like chicken and steak. That's exactly what your mother doesn't want. Why don't you do, why don't you do a disgust this way? I hate when you do that. I passed you like 900 times. Ask me or discuss things with me before you make a final decision. I haven't made a final decision. Well, don't make don't a decision. Have a don't say that they're going to do this that, and say that this and that. Well, then don't say it. It's going to bother me. Don't. Will you excuse me? Come with me, please. No. Come with me right now. Immediately right now. If you continue like this, I'm going to catch you. Mom! I'm dead serious. I can't stand you! I'm serious. Because I'm so opinionated. And I have been doing, I mean, this is my business. This is what I do for a living. I understand that she wants to be involved. But she goes a little, uh, oh my God. It's my party. She has to understand that it's my face going up on this. It's my name on the invitation. It's, this thing isn't about her. She just gets a bit carried away. She's a little too opinionated for me. It's about me and I want, it to be about me, and I wanted to be. I wanted to represent me with my like personal designs and opinions and stuff. She doesn't get one enough. It's enough. And don't listen to me, mom. Where's the rabbi? I don't have a book. Coming up on Party Party. Annabelle was in a panic. Where's the rabbi? I don't know the word. The rabbi is late. I bit off a little more than I can chew. And later, it's like Jews gone wild. straight the bar mitzvah's tomorrow i couldn't believe there was still so much that needed to be done all the displays that told people where they needed to sit needed to be set up and arranged i was pulling my hair out i wasn't sure that i would be able to do all the many details that needed to be done well i got to admit even for me this is pretty crazy with the toilet paper <laughs> Party snowballed on me. My husband's gonna come soon and help. I did this beautiful wallpapering job. It's nice to have the bar mitzvah. Uh, the party part seems like it's taken over our lives pretty much. I think I bit off a little more than I can chew. We're on the way to see the portrait artist that I've hired to make a portrait for Annabelle's bar mitzvah. Very special, very unique, very expensive. $8,500. Hi. Can't wait to see this. I've been commissioned by Carol Ann to create a portrait of our daughter Annabelle for her bar mitzvah. What happens with this piece, for example, is this gets married onto the white, which brings the color brilliance together. Annabelle is getting the coolest stuff for her bar mitzvah, but why, why not? She's got a cool mom. Right? Some days. Oh, oh my God. Wow. <gasps> wow. When Steve first revealed my portrait, I was just completely shocked. I never thought it would be that good. It was so gorgeous. I mean, can't tell the difference between me and her. It's you. <laughs> it's definitely you. The high you, hard run. The high you. Today is the day of my bar mitzvah, and it seems like I've forgotten the beginning of a prayer. I'm having like a major brain freeze. Hey, girls, let's go pray. I think it's food on the inside here, thank you. It's, it's a little too long. It's okay. It was long last night. Right in the middle of everything, I decided Dustin and Benjamin should read their speeches to me one final time. My family Seder might be a tad noisier than a traditional one. And just when I was really into listening to what they were saying, our parakeet started to squawk. But we do it because it is commanded in the Torah to teach the children of the pains and sufferings of Israelites in ancient Egypt. What better way to teach an ancient historical story? So annoying. I couldn't concentrate on anything. I just wanted to strangle that bird. Stay there. We finally got everyone out the door to drive to the synagogue. I arrived there and I saw the rabbi and I began to relax just a little bit hoping that things would go well. I 
twins got up there and made me really proud. Amen. Kihye Vecha Evion Meachad. It couldn't have actually gone any better in my eyes, and I think they were proud of themselves. You could see it in their eyes. Ka'asher Yevarechecha Adonai Elohecha. The summer ta Lifne Adonai Elohecha. The tour was hard. I messed up a lot, but no one really knew. Ki Evet Hayita Vemizraim. It was really touching for me to see both boys standing there with the rabbi. I thought everything went really well. I was very proud. My mom seemed pretty good. She didn't start crying at all. They're men now, and we're all really ready to party. Today is the morning of Annabelle's bar mitzvah, and she's going to get breakfast in bed like she always gets breakfast in bed. We're going to wind Annabelle up with a little sugar and let her go ballistic. Long day today for you. Are you ready? Are you nervous this morning? A little bit, right? I'm not have... as nervous as I will be when I get there. Like, I'm telling you, as soon as I get there, when I see everything, I'm going to be like... Ah! Okay, the panic is subsiding, Annabelle? No, we need mom to everyone to bring me checks instead of money. Oh, I love checks. There's only one thing better than a good present. It's a fat check. Ballroom, here it is. How are you? My mom and my dad have a pretty good relationship. Would this be the, the time to think about changing these long tables to round tables? I think it would be, you know, more suited for conversations or he's kidding mom too late. he's kidding although my dad can tease her sometimes but it's just for fun okay let's go dad and i what is today what day is today today is the 18th 17th the 19th okay because i told the rabbi said it was the 24th he was coming huh. oh no annabelle oh my god that i okay. will take over don't worry let's go give it to me in hebrew come on <laughs> and Brian Stylus comes up. All right, it's time to get dressed. Let's go. Okay. So did you bring all the jewelry? And... Yes. Okay, and the black dress. And then it kind of hits me that I've forgotten the black dress at home. Your last name? Black dress. Everything's been messed up. I have no idea what to do. Oh my god, I can't find I don't have a dress. Where is it? My dad. I don't have a dress. <laughs> Fifteen minutes before my bat mitzvah starts, in walks my dad carrying the black dress. Oh, thank you! Oh. I've never been so relieved in my entire life. And bye and everybody. Oh my god. It's here. Let's get it on you. The crises had been averted. It's five minutes to seven, and I need some serious help with my portion, but I can't find the rabbi. The rabbi is late. Oh, my God. Where's the rabbi? Why isn't the rabbi here? Mom, where's the rabbi? I don't know the words. Oh, honey, you have me nervous breakdown. It'll be fine. No, I'm not only... Okay, I promise. No, I don't. I just tried to recite it, and I can't get the things right. Annabelle was in a panic because she had forgotten her prayer book at home, and she couldn't remember the Hebrew, and the rabbi still hadn't shown up. I still don't know the words. You've got it. You'll know everything. I don't know anything. Where's my rabbi? I don't know the book. What am I going to read for? I'm going to go crazy. I don't know what's going on. Are my props out? What's in yeah, us? everything's out. Okay. Right at 5 o'clock, I could hear the guests greeting one another and asking where the party is. I think everyone's yeah. coming upstairs. I